welcome back to Super Hostile Delania. Kinda. We, we have literally left the map on our adventures. And now we are just kind of messing around. At least for now. There's a Cyclops in here. So we're going to take that out. I guess. We sure do have a rumbly sound. Man, he's got some he's got some health on him, doesn't he? This is gonna take a lot of arrows. Luckily we brought a whole bunch of extra arrows in our extra items. Packs. I don't know if this is really worth doing. Could have some treasure, I don't know. Not entirely confident in going to melee distance with this guy, so. I think arrows is the right choice. Also, it looks like zooming in with the bow is unloading the world around me. So that's interesting. I guess I'm no longer looking at it, so it isn't prepared for me to be so quickly not looking at it anymore. Well, that's fine. We got an advancement for that. Okay. Cool. He dropped cheap stuff. We got some wool. Ooh, manuscripts. And I guess we'll take some cobwebs. We don't need shears or wool, really. More manuscripts. Mutton's okay, though. Are these bone blocks? Yep. I'll take some bone blocks. Pretty sure they can only be turned back into bone meal and not bones. But at least it would save us using any bones for it, so that's fine. Very large bones. Okay. Then we have this ruin over here to look at. Then we should be done with this island. I'm not entirely sure what we're going to find in this ruin. That's worth a, worth a look, I suppose. Well, it's nice and dark. What's that? Lever there. What's this lever do? I made some sound. Oh, there's a downstairs passage. Okay. There's a whole bunch of there's a whole bunch of rock things down here. I'm not sure why everything here looks like rocks. Slightly concerned, actually. If I had to guess, there's a thing down here that can turn things to stone. Ah, oh, wow. Seriously? Gorgon. Wow. Instant death. That's fun. Thank you, the game. Wow. Okay. That's that's really great. Ugh. Wonder if those spawn naturally anywhere in actual Delania. Yikes. Okay. We get I don't know why it gives us a free stick. How's our backpack looking? Backpack tastic. 
All right, that's that's great. Thought that thought that might happen. Okay, great. Shovel, axe, bow, arrows, bread, water bucket. We're gonna need a backup of the backup atlas. Which is just book and compass, that's easy. If that's always down there, that's gonna be problematic. How do you, how do you kill something you can't look at? That's ridiculous. All right. Well, this is, this is fun. We're having a fun time. I guess the next question is, does the backup atlas have all the info in it already? And it does. Very good. Okay. We need some torches. We're gonna make out charcoal, of course. Way. Two sex torch is fine. Check the box is fine. We're gonna need a bed roll. Got some of those left over. We're gonna need a boat. And ladders. Might as well. And we've got our death marker on the map. Ooh, if we had a Ooh, that's an idea. What's it take to make a one of those waystones? A warp stone, which is an emerald, purple dye, and four ender pearls. Okay, I think that I don't think we have any ender pearls. Yeah, we had six ender pearls in total, and we used those all to make dragon heads. I guess technically, if our Monster Girls hadn't glitched out. We could trade stuff for Ender Pearls, but that's fine. Whatever. I guess since we're here, we can store away some of this loot. So we managed to find one diamond, I guess. Okay. And looks like we lost a few hearts. Great. Totally fair. Totally, totally a reasonable thing to have happened. That's still not enough heart crystals. Great. So now we're weaker than ever. Great. How fun. All right. So we get to boat through the open ocean again. Trying to avoid dying. We should be okay, I would say. Because even if we if, if we die again, it's like it's, oh, we don't have our magic mirror. We should probably we have a second magic mirror. We should probably bring it. Just in case we get into a situation where we can actually f escape without instantly dying. I know it costs something to use the waystones. I'm not exactly sure what it is. All right, the second magic mirror. Okay, and we got all our baubles still. Yep, we kept our baubles, our armor, our sword, and our pickaxe. And lost pretty much everything else. So, I guess that's okay. Better than losing everything, I guess. Kind of a kind of a weird middle ground, but whatever. 
I guess the next question is, how do we deal with that? How, how do you how do you fight something you can't look at? Also pick up all our stuff. It's an interesting question. I'm not sure what the answer is going to be. What I do know is we need to get moving. So we can be somewhere where we can sleep for the next night. We do have that one tiny little spot where we set up our bedroll on our first voyage. So this is also an opportunity to see if that hippogriff's still here. Because if it is, that'd be a very convenient second hippogriff to grab. Then we'd have a breeding pair. I'm not holding out much hope. We get to do this again. And the potential threat of sea serpents makes this still an interesting situation. It's not like we can just go straight back or anything. I mean, we killed that first sea serpent, but now our bow is a little bit worse. So, who knows? And I'm not seeing that hippogriff again, so. Oh, there it is. Though you do exist. You're flying, though. That makes everything difficult. You stay here, though. You, you just... You just hang out. So. We've got a hippogriff here, apparently. That's cool. So we just need to find... Rabbits. And potentially a second hippogriff. Then, there, then there's also the question of... Hey, you can't teleport back if you get a hippogriff out here. So that, that's a slight problem. And we also can't bring our rabbit farm with us. And we don't have the necessary tools to make a teleporter there. We can make the rabbit farm our house. I mean, we brought enough carrots. We can. We brought enough carrots and rabbits breed fast enough that we could just breed up a huge pile of rabbits. Hopefully get enough feet to tame some hippogriffs. Just said the question, would the bread hippogriffs give us tamed children? Didn't get that far in looking at any of this, so. We will worry about that if we manage to find rabbits. Because currently that seems like a big if. Everything seems very difficult. I might want to look up Gorgons before we get back there so I can know what I need to do. I'm wearing sunglasses, that should have worked. I say it should work. Anyways. First we need to cross the there's nothing actually here expanse of water. Which for some reason doesn't spawn sea serpents as far as I can tell. It's got regular biome names. I don't know. We never saw sea serpents besides that spawner in here. And then once we got outside the map. So I'm not sure exactly how this all works. I'm sure it's fine though. How many thousands of blocks is it to this island? My goodness. Anyways. We managed to get a hit in before we died, so it might... I'm not sure if I have to look at its face or what. I might review the footage, too. Because... I'm not against making this whole thing actually work for me here. And we didn't even need to explore that place. I'm just, I'm just curious. Exploring that temple is not going to get us... Well, it could get us diamonds. Also, we put one of the diamonds in our pack, in our chest back at home. So now we need to get one more diamond. And here's here's the outside world. So that's another thing to remember. 
We still have the same amount of diamonds that we had the first time, even though we found one. So that's good. Time to be vigilant of the siren mounds, siren rocks, and sea serpents. So far, that seems to be about the limit of the danger over here. But you never know. Ever vigilant. This is, this is a rescue mission at this point. Alright. Interesting. I was expecting a lot of boating today after we left that island. But I was hoping it to be boating to somewhere new. Not the same boating a second time. Which is... Highly unfortunate. But what are you going to do? Alright, we got some land looking. This is where it got high enough for me to... Put... Land on. Yes, ships. How are we doing on the daytime? Plenty. There's a siren... Rock. Those guys are really dangerous since we literally can't use earplugs. Which makes this mod pack a little bit more annoying again. Not that I would not that I would ever really have earplugs anyways, even if I was. I mean in RL craft the ocean's much worse, so I never even really bothered with it. Until we had flying. And then, even when we did have flying, we still got caught by sirens, I believe. So, anyways. Yeah, we, we could look at these ships. I don't... I just don't really care. Yeah, there's a small island over there. Oh, is that... Are we here? I don't think so. How are we doing on the map? We are almost getting there, kind of. I'll let me go check out this island over here, though. Looks like a tiny, tiny little island. Yep. Not where you want to spawn in these games. Ocean is not your friend. Speaking of which, let's avoid him. I said let's avoid him. Oh, there's another one. Still trying to get to the back to the regular island again. stress. A lot of pirate ships. A lot of pirate ships. I we looking on the map. It's more this way. We went a little bit further north this time to get around those sea serpents. Also looks like there's air underneath this ship. That's peculiar. Oh, there's a water type mountain kind of guy. Is this the island? Probably. Yep, there it is. Okay, so I'm going to do a quick research session, figure out what I need to do here, and try to get my stuff back. 
It's also becoming night. We should probably sleep. What I don't need is monsters all over the place. time as much as it would cause less monsters to spawn underground that's not really a huge concern of mine okay let's go figure some stuff out okay so we're gonna have some problems one way to do this is with a blindfold which we literally can't have so that's good. So we're just gonna have to go for it. Maybe it's maybe it's despawned. That would also be good. Apparently, you can get away with it by not having your crosshair on the Gorgon while you're fighting him. I don't know how much that's actually true. Whew. All right, here goes nothing. Okay, okay, there's monsters down here. I'm gonna pick up all my stuff and run around. Okay, inventory's full. Alright. All that stuff in here. Some arrows in this. Some of the things. Let's light it up down here. It's also flooded. That's interesting. There's our ladders. Anything else? Raw squid. That was an explosion. Oh, it's coming. Oh, it's coming. Don't want to deal with that. Okay. I think we got everything. Also, I want to get away from the ocean so nothing attacks me in the ocean. We got the good bow back. We got the extra that. We got the extra mirror. We got the axe. The saber. There's the shovel. Okay, I think I think we got it. I think we are back on track. Everything looking good? Yeah, we didn't actually as far as items that were on the ground, there wasn't too many, really. So yeah. There's our backup items here. Yeah, we got the bow back. We got the saber. Got the tools. There's a sea serpent on the land over here. We're gonna take care of that. Hey, sea serpent. <laughs> 13 green sea serpent scales. Okay. That's good. He attacked my head and did a ton of damage, because that's what happens. Alright. So what we need to do is we need to get... Make some space here. Look, touch, pick. All right, we don't need the second inventory, effectively. 
we're going to do is move this all. Oh, not the second mirror. Into some packs. I guess we can keep the boat. And the sea serpent's going to go back in there. Oh, there's a brain slime over there. Got to worry about that, too. Like touch pickaxe. Okay. I want the mirror on the bar, actually. Alright, I guess it is time to head back into the water again. I could kill the. I, I don't actually want to try to kill the Gorgon, it's too dangerous. If I had an easy way back here, I would, but I can't be bothered right now. I, I want to put another one of these. Oh, we can put the. We've got a backup of the backup in there, so that's fine. So we can delete this marker. There we go. Okay. What time of day is it? About that time. We have to worry about where we're going to be getting our next. Place where we can sleep, but that's fine. Because I still want to find actual land. Who knows how far this ocean's going to go, though. So. Also, it could just be a strip of ocean that just goes right this direction and no other direction, so... Yeah, whatever. Oh, that's that's higher. Ooh, that's well, that's land looking. That's land like. But is it just another island? Is the question. I could see more large islands. That wouldn't be too surprising. There's another one of those big ships with the air underneath them. Does that make sense? Let's come on the axe here. Let me get my boat back. Alright, we got brain slimes. It's brain slime beach. What do we have here? That's oh, a super brain slime. I set myself on fire, but I apparently don't care about that. Alright, we got a chicken. We got chickens. We got another one of those... Probably Gorgon things. That's good. That makes me happy. Uh, this, this is definitely looking like another island. We got the Cyclops. We got the Gorgon. Yeah. A second, equally terrible island. Let's not set off so close to the sirens. It is looking like it's island time today, which is unfortunate, of course. Onwards. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, that's totally a siren thing. Wow, look at all the stuff they got on their ships. I think a lot of the structures here make use of the various modded items. There's another sea serpent. Oh, it, sh it sure do be ocean, though. At least they're on the right track again. We're not going to find rabbits in the ocean, though. That's what we're looking for. So even if we find... We've, we have found a hippogriff. But that 
doesn't actually get us what we need. Some weird water turbulence on that. Avoid all the siren. It seems like there is a slightly smaller number of... Whoa, what is that? Structures available. So it keeps on doing the same things. This one's completely underwater here. That's different. It's like a giant tree of some description. Except it doesn't really have much in the way of leaves. So yeah, that might actually be more stone. That's an interesting structure. If I could fly, I could go see what's up there easily. <laughs> sure does look like a thing. But is it, is it a thing that contains diamonds or rabbits? That's why we're here. This looks like a big weird thing. I could totally see there being like a chest up there or something. So. Yeah, we might might as well look at it. As long as there's something that instantly kills me. That seagull agrees. The problems we face. Oh, we got a slime ball from something. And a fancy iron hoe. Okay. Sure, why not? I probably want torches. At least we have jumping power. We can get up there a little easier. A malice cultist. Uh, did I hit you? Sorry. I didn't actually mean to. There's some kind of cult hideout, apparently. That's different. Oh, the jumping. Oh, it do be good jumping. Sounds like there's a witch. A malice master. He's down there now. Everything just drops these weird little circles. Don't quite get what the circles are. Let's have a drink. Though. And reminisce on all the circles that we've gotten, apparently. It's like a staircase. Oh, wow, a lot of guys up here. Oh wow, is those the beacons? Oh, oh, so I could go some for some beacons. Stuff in here. Not sure where it's all coming from. Time's away. <laughs> Light witch. Yeah, these are beacons. Pickaxe is good. We can get these. Ho 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 ho! That's fun. I'll take some beacons. That's in that's interesting. Oh, and another beacon. Are they lighting their area with beacons? That's absurd. And I appreciate it. Mm. 
Any more beacons? I'd like to take more beacons, please. This is, a, this is an interesting location to find. What do you got in your chest? Inventory blocks to the evil. They're not open for your closest enemy marked. Okay, so I guess we need to kill everyone before we can take their chest. That's fun. There's a guy. Get them here. We're well, in a really awkward location. shieldy thing. It's an iron shield. Oh, they actually do have a, a lot of bats. There was like a location down here. Does this continue? Doesn't look like it. Any more guys I need to take care of? Sharpness 3, Wand Melee Upgrade, Books, Paper, An Empty Map, Tome of Arcana, Fancy Scrolls, More of whatever these are. They don't stack really weird, they stack really weird. We got a engineering station, we got rotten flesh, a poison bomb, a spell book, a spell of identification, watermelon seeds. Oh, uh, we are. We are chock full of items now. Chock full of really weird items, too, so that's fun. We're going to plop down the ender chest. Right next to this waterfall, apparently. Start just dumping things in here. Third backpack. Got some name tags. Always good. Sandal, bone, wild seeds, poison bombs. Got some poison bombs. We got poison bombs. Also have glowstone if we wanted that anymore. I already have that. I can put this atlas back in the. Alright. Okay. Cool. What do we have over here? Ink sacks, another wart. Empty chest. Another wart farm. I'll take some of these mushrooms, I guess. I already have another work farm, so I'm not too concerned about that. So farming mushrooms actually takes a little bit more effort, so. We will take what we can find. Apparently, what we can find is a whole bunch of mushrooms and stuff. Some more chests over here. Got empty chest. Ink sacks. Mushrooms, feathers, bones, spell books that don't stack, scroll of identification, up in the furnaces, 
A bunch of slime balls, that's fun. I like that. Poisonous potatoes, but I don't need those, we'll take them anyway. Empty chest. Furnace, furnace. Alright. Well, this is a cool place. I like the way that the mod works where you have to actually defeat the structure before you can take all this stuff. That's pretty cool. I think that's good for here. Is this just an island again? Any cool stuff on the top of your top? Doesn't look like it. Ah! Were we hit by lightning? That was a witch. I guess we were hit by lightning then. It was just lightning shot by a witch. Another wart jar, speed and haste, okay. Alright, looks like it's coming nighttime again. Also, is this another island? Oh, it connects over there. Maybe it's not an island. I don't want to get out of here. I don't want to sleep first. An iron sword of sharpness. Alright. Well, we got some beacons. That's interesting. So this we could put like. Do we have enough stuff to make a beacon? We got we got an absolute ton of gold blocks. <laughs> yes, yes, we have plenty of stuff to make a beacon. That is a non-issue. Once we get back to base. And then a decor credit. Make that water. Probably. Nobody cares about you. Let me know. We don't jump while we're in the water, though. So that's the thing. Yeah, this looks it's like Okay, it's not. It might not be an entirely just an island. Oh, we're looking like it. That thing's looking on the book. Hard to tell. Oh, it's nice and slow. Let's use the boat. Yeah. Convenience. Efficiency. Boating. Alright, this has a lot of trees on it, so maybe this is actually the way to an island. Or, it's the way to not an island, rather. I guess that, that is the dream. Yeah, here. Ah! You good? There's an actual owl. Wild berries. And a wild berry bush. I don't know if these can regrow the wild berries, so I'm going to take a few of them. Alright, what do we got? We got treetops, which are slower to walk in, so we're going to get out of them. Still looking potentially islandy. There's still more. Maybe it's not an island. Nah, it's definitely an island. It's an island. Nope. It's a river. Still, nowhere where you're going to find any rabbits. 
If only the Cyclopses kept rabbits instead of sheep would be good to go. It's like a weird island chain so far. Pirate base or something. Oh, they be do they do be turning the cannon. What y'all doing? I'm coming up there. Come wait up for me. They just sit there and take it. That that's. That's one strategy, I suppose. Ah, there's like... Pirates. Oh, they got a little campfire. How nice. How nice for them. Pirates don't stand a chance. Really unfortunate for them. There's just layer after layer of dead pirates. Turrets. We good? Did we take out all the pirates? Did I loot their chests. Steal their cannons. There's, there's one guy down there. Fine. Where is he? gonna decorate my base with cannons. That's the new plan. I love how I can't steal their chests until they're all dead, but I can easily just take all their cannons. Does that make sense? Where's this pirate guy? He is in the ground. That's that's a different strategy, I guess. Zombies down here. There are, in fact, many zombies down here. Oh, it does have an entrance to the outside. Okay, interesting. It's like the pirate secret base. Secret chest, secret cool loot. Oh, it's secret cool loot, it's diamonds. That's what I'm talking about. This, this was worth it. Wow, look at that. Seven diamonds. Oh boy. Let's see if there's any good loot up in the base. I want this. Square fire pit unlit. Okay. We got potatoes, we got wheat, beef, bucket of milk. 
15 arrows. What if you can destroy the chests without having to kill everybody? Pig spawner. Don't know if that's actually gonna spawn pigs. That might spawn pirates. I mean, we killed all the pirates, so maybe not. Ah, we, we saw our sun. Well, I guess we're. I guess it's still a safe spawn point, so that's fine. Unfortunate. Well, we live here now, I guess. Great. Oh, when we die here and. Oh, that, that's. That's not ideal. Kind of, kind of don't want that to be a thing, actually. Mm. If we die here, well, now I need to set up. A, oh, what, what? This, this just had a lot of items in it. We got golden apple, a storm mage robes. Recall potions, wormhole potions, old horse armor, gunpowder. How did we miss that chest? All right, that, this is problematic. Because we are here, where we'd want to spawn is there. Mm. No, not what we wanted. This just looks like an, some islands again. Do we dare risk going forwards? There's stuff here. This was a problem that could happen, so I need to. That, that's one problem with being able to set your spawn when it's not night. You can accidentally set your spawn. I guess that just would have made, made a difference if I clicked that at night, but oh well. Hmm. All right. Do I want to put something here that would help me potentially get back to where I was going? I would, I would need an atlas. Ah, uh, I don't know. If I destroyed my new spawn point, it would send me back to the map start. I think that's what I prefer. Because from there, I could easily work my way back to Delania. I think we're just going to destroy our spawn point. Spawn point is missing or obstructed. Do I dare use the magic mirror? I kind of need to know what happens to the magic mirror. I mean, I guess my spawn point is now the start of the map, so that's fine, I guess. Alright. I think that's the right call. So I'm going to put all this stuff in my ender chest. Maybe I'll test out on the test world where Magic Mirror brings you if you don't have a spawn point set. And then we will continue on Trying to find land where we can go dig for diamonds, try to find some rabbits, try to get a hippogriff. This is weird. This is this is this is not super outside the line at this point. We're just we're just trying here. We're just trying here. Everything's really dangerous. And I really want to be able to fly. That's why we're here. Not having much luck of it yet. We will continue, I guess, east. Try to find the mainland, if, if if such a thing exists. Next time. Goodbye.